Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gents, this is going to be a short video letting you know about the QPAC. The QPAC is no longer available. The QPAC has been archived. The QPAC, for those of you who are QPACers, if you want to go back and understand the agreement, see it says this program is no longer offered and has been suspended. Please do not inquire as it has been archived permanently. The QPAC, to keep its value, to keep the QPAC's value, we suspended the program. Many of you are QPACers. The QPAC is one of our most valued programs besides the Omega Pack. You received, if you are a QPAC member, your tax credits as a result of your QPAC. What you're going to need to do to get to the QPAC section, you're going to have to go to the SACOM website. Nope, not that one. Sorry. Went back too far. You're going to go to this first page. You're going to click on drop down menu. You're going to click on a drop down menu and it's going to say prior programs. You're going to click on prior programs. You're going to come to this page and you're going to slide down as soon as it lets me. And you're going to come to this section right here, this box right here. And it says click on the following link to access the archive section. You're going to click there. It's going to take you here. You're going to come up here to the corner. Say, hi, corner. How you doing? And it's going to, when you click on it, it's going to say the Q pack. You're going to click on the Q pack. And guess what it's going to do? It's going to take you to the page that we were on originally. Ladies and gentlemen, if you've received the tax credits, then you need to complete a 1099-C. Now, against the entity for which the QPAC originally was. So whomever your QPAC was sent to is the entity you're going to need to complete a 1099-C. You as the creditor, they as the debtor, so that you can receive the additional credits for the forgiven debt. The actual credits given to you by the QPAC does not account for this. That would be additional. Understand what's going on here. You have your contract. You have proof that it was served. You also have proof of its recording. Ladies and gentlemen, take your QPAC. Recognize your QPAC has a value. A hundred million dollars was the standard for each QPAC. That allows you to document an additional, pay attention, $100 million for the security. Because the security is not backed by the SACOM organization. The security is backed by the agreement itself between the parties. The other party is in default. That's your 1099-C. Okay? Do your 1099-Cs. Document your credits. We'll be providing you more videos in the future on this. Remember, the partner, partner, partner for which your QPAC is aligned with can go on a K-1. Do your research, everyone. We'll speak to you later. Have a good day, all. We are gone.